Hey there, it's Nancy Tierney, and today is Tuesday, which means it's Tough Love Tuesday. And on this Tough Love Tuesday, I want to talk to you about epiphanies, those big dramatic moments where the heavens open up and all becomes clear and you know what to do and you're, you feel empowered to take a risk and you go forth and make it happen. <laughs> Because just the other day I was watching a video by one of these up and coming transformational self-help guys. Um, and he's, he's a cool dude. I like him. He's very down to earth. He's not pretentious. But he was telling his story about how he is where he is today because of, of how he followed his guidance or this event happened and, and kind of that same thing where he took a stand and it was another one of those stories. Not quite as dramatic as some, but it still was one of these stories that we're used to in the entrepreneurial world where someone wakes up in the middle of the night and something becomes clear or something happens to them and, and they make this life-changing decision or um, th those dramatic moments. And they're also Hollywood, you know? <laughs> it's like the guy sweeping in to rescue the woman or the woman taking a stand for herself. A lot of these stories we hear are very dramatic, very Hollywood. Um, and that's fine, and except that when we start envying them, which we can do, like, well, where's my Hollywood moment? You know, where's my big epiphany? When am I gonna have these lightning bolts of clarity that other people seem to have and, and feel energized to take that big risk even though I don't know what's gonna happen? And I just wanna let you know that there's something else as equally valuable maybe not as dramatic, but as equally important. And it happens to you almost every day. And that's what I call heart tickles. <laughs> it's just where some idea or possibility or maybe something someone said just kind of makes your heart flutter a little bit. It's like there's a little bit of excitement there and you go, ooh, you know, I like that idea or oh or you just kind of get this kind of a little bit of jolt of more energy and they happen all the time if you're paying attention you'll get an inspiration and you'll have a physical response your heart will respond and those are what I call like tiny epiphanies they're like little tiny epiphanies and if you follow them the results can be the same as the big dramatic <laughs> <laughs> earth-shattering, life-changing, big moment epiphanies. It's hard to believe that because they're not so, you know, dramatic, but one leads to another. And if you start following these little heart flutters like, yeah, I'm going to follow that. That's exciting to me or that's interesting or even that's curious. It will lead to another and one will lead to another. And this is how you follow your excitement. This is how you follow your own path of epiphany. It's quieter, but it's just as, as effective and in some ways maybe a little bit saner. You might not be able to write a Hollywood story about it, but value them. Start listening to those moments of inspiration, those moments where you just feel a little something extra because that is your guidance. That is your inspiration telling you, Come on, come this way. <laughs> There's good stuff down this path. All right. So big epiphanies. Good, great. If you got them, have them. <laughs> have them, write about them, share them. But if not, no big whoop. Just follow your little heart tickles. They're the same thing. They're just subtler. <laughs> All right, that's it for this Tough Love Tuesday. I'll see you back here next week. All right, bye. <laughs>